My intellect is without limit. Stacks back. And I have an invader today. Stacks Jr. I have Stacks Jr. here with me today. You want to say hi to the people? Look. Look at the camera. Want to say hi? He says hi. <laughs> he stole my hat. And he's got his tablet here. So I was getting ready to record this intro and he woke up and then came in here and invaded me. So he's in the intro with me now. But um, yeah, I'm back and we're playing some more meal today. I know my last video was historic meal. This one's going to be standard. Um, I, I've gotten some requests for people to they ask me how how good how would you build meal for standard because not everybody plays historic. So this is my take on meal for standard, which is pretty good actually. Um, before I get into the deck tech, though, I just want to remind everybody if you're watching this video and you have not subscribed, hit that subscribe button helps me out a lot. If you like seeing an intelligent brewer such as myself doing magic content with a stimulated brain, stimulated from the sativa plants. <laughs> no, if you like if you like the content, if you enjoy the content, go ahead and hit the subscribe, hit that like button, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Um, but let's get into the deck tech here. Um, I've been running this in best of one. Um, I, haven't, I, don't, I haven't been playing very much best of three. I tried to get some Omnath decks in the gameplay, but for some reason today, the game did not want to match me up against Omnath. Yesterday, I kept seeing all nothing but Omnath decks, but today, I couldn't get any Omnath decks. So, um, I think in best of three, it's probably riddled with Omnath decks, but the, the downside to trying to play a mill deck in best of three, um, especially going up against Omnath, is that they're better prepared for it um, once you mill them out. If you manage to mill them out in game one, They'll go to the sideboard and be better prepared to deal with you milling them out. So, I don't recommend this in best of best of three. Um, if you want to rank up with this, is this is definitely best of one deck because you don't give the Omnath deck a chance to adjust to you milling them out. Um, Omnath is still a superior deck, in my opinion. But going in best of one when they're not as prepared to deal with your mill, um, you can get them. You can be consistent winning with this in best of one because they. They aren't prepared to defeat Mill um, versus if they have a chance to sideboard. So um, no sideboard for this. Um, but hey, if you want to run it in best of three, go ahead and give it a shot. <laughs> so I got four Secret Keeper, Merfolk Secret Keeper, four Ruin Crab, four Blood Chief, uh, Blood Chief's Thirst, uh, four Frantic Inventory, one uh, Jahari uh, Disruption. For Maddening Cacophony, for Drown in the Lotch, for Mystical Dispute. Mystical Dispute is really good. It's hit, it hits a lot. Um, you know, they play the Omnath on cra on 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 uh, on turn on curve. Excuse me, can't speak today. They play the Omnath on curve, um, which is usually turn three, which is insane because it's a, a four different color pip creature that's supposed to be extremely hard to cast, but it typically comes out on turn three in the Omnath deck so <laughs> yeah wizards the four different mana colors is not a deterrent all right but yeah you got mystical dispute they play their Omnath on on turn three you go ahead and counter it for one blue mana and um i think that's the only really so real solid way to deal with Omnath in my opinion because if you let them play it and they and they you know they already it already replaces itself it's a can tripping spell uh can tripping card i mean so you know, it comes into play, they draw a card, they've already replaced it. Um, you kill it, they've already gotten value off of it, even if they don't get any landfall triggers. So, um, you counter it, it's a true way of making them be down a resource. So, you gotta, you gotta have, you gotta be ready for Omnath. Uh, four, four Teferi's Tutelage, two Thirst for Meaning, four Into the Story. Then for the lands, I got seven Island, four Swamp, four Clearwater Pathway, three Temple of Deceit, and three Fabled Passage. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I know the historic build I did for Mill was mono blue, but you're running Brovok in, in, in historic, so um, you you can afford to be mono blue and just go mill, 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 and mill them out as much as you can because Brovok gives you so much extra mill. Um, but in standard, we don't have Brovok, so you have to kind of you have to kind of take the the control approach, right? So you have to be able to remove the the, the threats that you need to remove, and you need to be able to have Secret keepers and crabs blocking the things um, to keep them from getting to you and, and help you survive. Yeah, we have to try to survive long enough to mill them out, son. 
So that's why I took this approach um, with the standard version of meal. Um, if anything that I might add would be, um, I probably would take out the thirst for meaning and put in, there's a, there's a card, it, it's an escape card where you get to remove something from an opponent's graveyard, but you have to exile five cards to escape it, and then it draws your card. I might think about switching that in, in for a thirst for meaning, but when you got two Lidge out, thirst for meaning is just so much better. I mean, just the, the meal that you get off of thirst for meaning. You never want to see too many of it. That's why I only got the two of in here. But I mean, when, when you really, when you have it and you need it to go ahead and finish a person off, thirst for meaning comes through a lot of it. It, it, it comes through when it needs to come through. So um, it's a solid card for the deck. It's more solid in my opinion than than the escape card that I've seen other people trying to use um, with their with different variants of blue black meal that I've seen floating around. So yeah, this is my variant. This is my version. Um, shout out to to um, Black Lotus uh, on a, in the MTG Arena group. Um, he's a, a fellow streamer, um, and he was recently um, playing at a high level at the I think it was the Mythic Invitational or something like that. Um, but yeah, I seen him playing a version of Blue Black Meal too on stream uh, earlier. I think it was yesterday, or it might have been the day. I don't remember. You know the plants. They sometimes blur the days together. <laughs> but yeah um shout out to him because um yes yeah, it's, it's good to see i'm not the only one that's putting meal on the map so enough of that i'm gonna go put Stax jr away into his room with his video games and let's get into the action all right let's go ahead and keep this gonna be a slow start off here is this rogues I don't know what this is must be some kind of blue black control oh oh this is Grix's control all right Grix's control I don't know what this person's gonna play here. I don't I don't see Grix's control too much. Keep that land there. Don't play something? Sure you can have the tone. might have counter magic I don't know it might be that that one where you have to pay one extra which is fine if it is all right I don't need I don't need any more land uh, I might as well play this now so I can have some defense it may drop a Ashiok I didn't think about that that might be what he's going for. Bone Crusher Giant. I uh, hope he doesn't drop an Ashiok. Ashiok's a five drop, right? That'll be problematic. Alright, just a bone crusher. I can deal with that. Deal with bone crusher. Wookie. Wookie of the year. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and use these. I prefer to use these while Ruin Crab is out, but since apparently the game thinks I didn't put Ruin Crab in my deck. All right, I'm gonna eat some bone crusher, some bone crusher damage here. I don't feel like wasting my removal on bone crusher giant. 
I'm trying to be a smart Wookie. That'd be smart. I haven't milled him very much. No blocks. I'll take you four for now. Hmm. I sniff counter magic. So I better I better hold on to my end of the story until I can uh use my own counter magic. Gotta gotta play around this person's counter magic here. I know Grix's control has to be running counter magic. It wouldn't be right if it wasn't. Why don't you just draw? Just draw the card. Help me out. Help a meal player out. Anything else? Alright, you gonna make a shark? Uh, I can go ahead and use this in response. Um, I'm gonna discard this Temple of Deceit because uh, having tap tap lands right now isn't uh, exactly ideal. It's not beneficial to me. Got 28 cards left. I think we're gonna get there swiftly. I'm gonna block this bone bone crusher here. All right. Blocking the Bone Crusher. Uh, he can counter this Frantic Search if he wants. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this. All right, that's enough of the lands. Uh, how many cards he got left? 24. I'm gonna use Cacophony. Gonna counter it. Alright. Um. I, I, I really don't care if he counters it. Go ahead and get this down for blue. Uh, let's go ahead and play. No, I'm going to save this. I'm going to hold this one up for the next turn. I'll just say go. Got to hold my effects up. Hold my drone in the lotch. Drone in the lotch. For Mr. Wookie. With the Wookie Terrian. Still no uh still no uh Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill uh I'm gonna kill his bone crusher. Oh wait, I don't wanna kill a bone crusher, I'm gonna kill the uh I'm gonna kill a flyer. Trade your three three off for two two. That's fine. Only card I'm really worried about here is Ashiok. Ashiok will return my tutelage to my hand. Alright. Taking seven. But you're uh you're pretty much done. Next turn here. Sorry to tell you. 
All right, if he plays the Ashiok at this point, he's got five mana. Yeah, Ashiok gets countered. Another Tome, that's fine. Oh, he's really done now. <laughs> uh, you want to counter this draw spell? Please, counter it. No? All right, uh, I'll pitch these two land. I don't need those. Oh, there's a Kroxa. Too bad it'll never see the light of day. It will never get to escape. It's prison. You have 13 cards left. Uh, I'm gonna draw four. <laughs> I ain't draw any land. <laughs> oh, the tears. Oh, there's another Kroxa. Well, sorry, buddy. Sorry, it's over. <laughs> Good game. Oh, I got these. It's crying now. <laughs> oh, I have to discard. Bye, Ruin Crap. You didn't help me. <laughs> oh, going up. Going up and right here. Well, this is a very bad hand, as one can see. But I can't keep it. This is. I guess I gotta keep this. Uh, I'm actually gonna put the tutelage back here. Well, no, I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put back to dispute. I may end up regretting that, but. And I don't want to get. All right, well I'm gonna go ahead and play this. Just start the mill. So I don't, I don't know what my opponent's playing anyway. So what is this? Some kind of Boros, Boros mid range. All right. like to get a land all right yeah that definitely has to die uh, is that a warrior this pumps of the knights uh, I need a land man I'll go ahead and use this now because I need a land all right Oh, all right. Well, I'll take your five. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and kill that now. Draw some more cards. I need some land. There we go. Let's go ahead and mill you some more. As long as you control another warrior, you don't control another warrior right now. Pitch one of these lands. Miss Lazo. Oh, there's a warrior. All right, I don't want to take another five. All right, get this tutelage down. Oh, that's nice. Get rid of this passage. Wow, 
Why is this fervent champion in there? He's not a warrior. All right, let's go ahead and kill. Let's go ahead and kill that. Uh. Eh, I'll block it. Actually, no. I'm going to save it. I can take the four for now. Alright. Let's draw some cards. Uh... Guess I got to pitch these two. Alright, as long as they don't kill me this turn, I should have this. It's going to be close. They got some big damage on board here. Embercleave would end me. Another one of those, but that doesn't kill me. All right, well, you die. You die. Cry. <laughs> Cry. Cry. <laughs> Miss Lazo! 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 And because your guys keep hitting me, I'm gonna kill it. Kill it! <laughs> yeah! Well, there's a ruin crab. I haven't. I've gone a lot of matches without getting the turn one ruin crab. Everybody else seems to always have them against me. Very peculiar. Of course my my land would be a tap land here. I'm gonna fall behind. Uh alright. Gonna fall behind here. gonna be behind the curve all right let's go ahead and get the crab down I'm gonna play this now oh there's a Ugin win in the graveyard oh this is they're ramping into big planeswalkers all right ramping to planeswalkers means I got to keep counter magic up for those Saw a Garrick and a and a Ugin. Oh, there's a snake. There's a snake. All right, I gotta I gotta get them to I gotta get them to uh, eight cards in the graveyard in a in a hurry here, so I can be able to counter counter Ugin. Hold up that counter magic. You can attack me with your snakes. Whatever it is, it will not resolve. If it's a threat. I don't think you can get to Ugin yet, though. Got five, six. I care about that. Oh. Uh, well, yeah, I think I better counter that. I don't want him having too much power on board.
Fuck the snake. Oh. Oh, there's a Pelucranos. Pelucranos. Um. I think. I need another black here. Well, no. I only need blue. Well, I'm gonna need a black though, in case in case they do put down, they manage to get something down. I'm gonna need another black. So I'll get that down now. And uh, I'm gonna hold up all my mana. I can use into the story to draw some cards. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need the resources here. All right. Can't you gotta put down a you gotta play a land to unearth your Pelucranos here. Alright. I'm gonna let this one resolve. Same drill my crab will block your snake. Any cards, 31 cards, and draw. Alright. I definitely want the land. Let's, uh, let's kill your giant. All right, if they play a Perlu Perlucranos, it gets countered. And then I just finish them off next turn with the Cockaponies. Yeah, that gets countered, buddy. Calco ponies, finish them off. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, and you can take zero. Take it. <laughs> Ugin can save you. <laughs> this is bad. Can't keep it. This is better. Put the inventory back. Crap. Oh. Guess they don't want to play against Mill. Well, this isn't ideal, but got removal, got counter. I'll keep it. Maybe this person's playing blue. Blue's running rampant right now. May be able to catch them off guard with a dispute. There's a black. Black is usually accompanied by blue. No green. Oh. Ain't seen one of those in forever. Yeah, hello. Um, uh, well, that's not really a threat. They can have that. I'd rather use my inventory. Okay. Fetch your land. Gonna hit me for two. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna save the inventory and just discard it to tutelage. Well, there's a there's another inventory. Uh, let's discard the inventory. 
I bet the hand is full of creature removal. Oh, there's that. I'm really tired of Lucky Clover. Lucky Clover needs to go. It needs to go away. Like really bad, go away. This person... Alright, they're trying to get the, uh, the life thing off of, uh... They're trying to get the double activation of the life. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna just save and draw cards with uh, frantic inventory. Yeah, they're trying to get the double activation of I lose life for the knights and all that good stuff. I don't know what made them think that Lucky Clover was ever okay. For, for a mechanic that already has card advantage. Essentially having a... Having a, a, a adventure card is like having two spells in your hand. So if you have a, card, a handful of adventure spells. Then um, you basically have 14 cards and I have 7. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and use this now. Alright, get the crab down. And I'm just gonna hold up. Hold up counter magic. Although they can pay for anything that they want to play. Okay, he's going to go for the kill on both of my crabs. Going for the kill on both of my crabs. And he's going to make me discard two cards. Hmm. Well, he has to pay four for that. All right, that's fine. Let's see which one he goes for first. He may go to kill the crowds first. Oh, he's going for the discard. All right, well, let me go ahead and draw cards. <laughs> yeah, both the crabs and tearing it up with this mill deck. I feel like mill is the only thing that that you can consistently be Omnath with right now, and that's if you get ahead of them on the mill. Because Omnath draws so many cards that they end up like helping you. Hello. My my uh emote is crying. <laughs> I'll say hello. Hello. No mutate. Alright, let me go ahead and get this. Ah! I should have played my other crab. What am I doing? That's what I get for clowning around. Quit clowning around, stacks. All right, I'm sure he's gonna mutate. All right, gaining life. All right, well, that doesn't kill my crap. I feel like I need to have a counter magic here. I 
I need to have a counter magic. All right, it's gonna mutate. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't want you drawing cards. Let's not have you drawing cards. I need to draw. Feel like that missed uh that missed trigger on my crab is gonna have me regretting here. When I forgot to drop my crab. Alright, I'm really taking these three damages. Alright, let me draw. Alright, cool. Got another crab. Set him down. Get all the mill triggers. Fear. Fear the mill. Alright, if he goes for a mutate with a Starks or something on here, which I'm thinking he will do, I'm gonna kill it in response. Oh, I don't want your guy flying. Well, I could let it mutate and then kill it. Cause what is he gonna get? He's gonna get he's gonna gain life. Uh he's gonna draw a card. Uh, but he won't have a creature, so he won't be attacking me next turn. Let's go ahead and kill it. Yeah, good game. How many cards you got left? None. <laughs> None. Not enough to live. <laughs> Trying to stay focused here. Game six of the NBA Finals is going on right now, so I've been kind of a little distracted. Um, yeah, I guess I keep this. Got removal and all that good stuff. Tutelage seems good. Seems good here. Oh, what are they playing? Is this going to be rogues? I think this is rogues. Oh, you should have played your rogue. Um, well, I think, I think Tutelage gets countered here, so I'm not going to play it. They're going to have that counter unless I pay one. Yeah, I'm going to counter your rogue here. Yep, pretty sure they have that, uh, they, they probably even have, uh, Drown in the Locks themselves. So, yeah, let's find out. They may want to counter this crab. Nope, no counter on the crab. Gonna kill it? Alright. Um, I'll let them kill the crab. I'm not gonna fight over the crab. I will play my tutelage now though. Oh man, I really would like that dispute. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna push this thirst for meeting because the dispute is actually very valuable here. All right, play this land. Uh, I just say go. Uh, yeah, that gets countered. He gets countered too. Alright, I'm all out of cards here. I need a into the story. Alright, I might as well play this for some defense. I didn't I did not want that I don't I didn't want this land either I don't need any lands right now let's go ahead and thin these lands out all right any cards that got left 32 all right there's a frantic inventory could have used that They may try to hit me with a, whatever that guy name is, Zareth or whatever, steal my crab. It's not going to work out for them though. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here, here comes the, the uh, agent of treachery. <laughs> agent of treachery reborn into a merfolk. Man, I'm psychic. Psychic. And he dies. Die! Yeah, let's counter your counter. I'm gonna fight. I'm not gonna I guess I should put down the crab um then I'll have to kill it make them waste the removal on it I just need some I need something to generate some card advantage here now there's another tutelage I'd rather not play it right now because if I play this I guarantee you I'll draw I'll draw um, my draw spells so I need to I'm gonna wait until I have something that I know what I'm gonna be discarding to it because I would hate to play tutelage and then pick up a into the story gonna hit me with another Zareth who's that guy's name yeah Zareth Oh, they went to Zareth into the graveyard. Well, I think they probably have counter magic. Or they probably have more uh, merfolk to flash in. So I'm going to go ahead and go ahead for the, the kick, Capricorni. Counter it. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We weren't. I'd rather you waste the counter on that. All right, Brazen Bar coming up. He's looking at my tutelage. All right, there's another crab. Didn't really want him. 
Brazen Bar. Yep. Three tutelages now. Want to counter it? All right, that's fine. You have you're all out of counters now, so. I think I, I can race them with the mill, so I'm not really worried about killing their guys now. Alright, taking four. Alright. Land, don't want that. There's a counter spell went in the grave. Let's go ahead and play tutelage. Wanna scry? Wanna scry now? So it can go into the grave, whatever you keep on top? Ice Neon Flames. Flames. All right, yeah, I don't need this land. I need this counter magic. Counter magic is more important in this spot. All right, what you got? I know you got 10 cards left. I know that. Oh, another tutelage. Um, I really don't care about the Ruin Crab. Ruin Crab isn't doing anything for me right now. <laughs> Ruin Crab is not doing anything. He's not even the one mealing you out. It's over for you. It's over. <laughs> Sorry, rogues. Oh, tier one with meal. Oh man, what is this? This is an atrocious hand. Would have been nice if I'd have had an additional land, but do I risk it? Oh, it's not worth the risk. All right, this is better. Keep six. Put the thirst for meaning back. Scry. Sure, I'll take another one of those. Can't have too many counters and removals. Uh, sure. I'm gonna draw two. Let's draw together. Together. Oh. Gonna be making Krakens. Um, well. Need blue. Alright, now we got counter magic up for anything that they can play here. I don't see people using this ominous seas too often. Do you have a okay, you don't have one in your grave. I let that resolve. Play this with some defense. I don't know if he's got any creatures. Like we both hurting on land here. 
Yeah, I don't. I don't want you having that one. Might draw into some land. If I'm gonna be stuck on land, I want you stuck on land too. Man, I need some land. Okay. Can't do anything about your cycling. Okay, I'm not gonna counter our opt. Good thing about it is they're making they're making the mill a lot easy. <laughs> a lot easier. Oh there we go, there's a lane. Thirty-one cards left. We're halfway there, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Uh, I don't want you having that one. Two of them would be problematic. Well, I would like some card draw at some point. Sure, you're going to get your cracking now. You have your cracking. You happy? Uh I guess I guess sure. Go ahead and uh, actually, I rather I'll just take the eight. I'm gonna take the eight here because I'd rather use my thirst to blow up the Kraken. There we go. There's the end of the story. By cracking. Uh, yeah, we definitely can't let that resolve. All right, they don't play anything. I'm gonna draw cards here. Well, if they draw a bunch of cards, that's fine. Uh, no, we can't let that resolve. Well, let's go ahead and get Tutelage down. That's a great pickup. Get rid of this land. Twenty four cards. I don't think you're going to make it, Kerr. Oh, there's another tutelage. I'm going to be greedy. You going to counter it? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. I lost connection. I'm back, though. Oh, they're playing blue. We got dispute. We've got dispute. Ready. Yeah, let's counter your crab. I'd rather not be the one being milled. I prefer to be doing the milling. I prefer to be doing the milling. No, oh, I said you cannot have crabs. I I don't have crabs, so you can't have them. <laughs> Turn one crab. Definitely a keeper. P 
DDP. Oh man. Oh no. That's not good. Well, might as well go ahead and get this down tap. I'm gonna need the card draw. What is this? Mono Green Adventures? Oh. Gruel Adventures. I probably can pitch a land here. Because I think the crab is probably going to bite the bullet. Oh, there's another crab. Alright, well, maybe not. Uh, I know I'm going to need removal. I think I just pick, pitch a... Inventory here. Crab is probably going to bite the bullet here. Probably going to get that double stomp. Unless he wants to fetch up some lands. So there's only two plays right now fetching lands or burning the crab off the field. Oh. Oh, this is Teamer Adventures. Never mind. <laughs> Come on, Mew. Wait, this is Omnath. Is this Omnath Adventures? I think this is. With why is Garrick's Harbinger in there? I haven't seen any Omnaths yet. All right. At least I'll get to keep one crab now. He won't be able to burn them both off the field. You can bounce them though. Alright, what you got? Alright, ain't too much word about that. I can kill him. Alright, let's go ahead and kill him. Oh, wait a minute. I could kill it with Drown and Lotch instead of one of these, but. and hold up counter magic so I don't get ate by something. Uh, man, that's a hard, that's a hard decision here. If he plays something blue, I'll have mana to be able to counter it. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk this. I'm gonna risk it. Oh, another one. Alright, well, I guess same drill. I'll just go ahead and kill this guy. So I don't think this is Omnath. I don't see I haven't seen an Omnath going to graveyard yet. This is just they have the triome in here just I guess for fixing. Alright, crab biting the bullet. Oh! <laughs> Ranking up! Well, I can kill stuff and I can counter stuff, so I'll keep it. Need some meal cards though. There we go. There's a meal card. Oh, rogues. Well, let's kill her. Oh, 
Oh. Ain't seen that in forever. Uh. I really need a land. It's unfortunate I didn't get one. Falling behind here. I don't have land. Alright, there's a land. Really needed another blue, though. Sure. Draw. Uh, I'm gonna kill this guy because I don't want him to start like I don't want him to be hitting me for five C dub Come on, man. I'm mana screwed. You you taking all this long? What'd you, what'd you add blue mana for? Alright, no point in playing the crap. I can't play anything right now because I gotta keep up counter magic. Alright, draw your cards. What is this? Is this like some kind of like weird altered rogue? I don't know. People playing these weird things. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, I think I need. Do I really care about this? Uh,. I don't want him to be milling me. I think I need to I need to kill this. Wanna counter it? Thought about it. That lets me know he, he has a counter. Let's see if I can get the crab to resolve. Alright. Um, if I play Tutelage, I know it gets countered right now. So let's not do that. <laughs> I suspect Crab is going to bite the bullet. Alright, clean the dust. Well, you've got all the lands and you've got card advantage on me, so. Alright, crab biting the bullet. Alright. Well. Going for tutelage right now would be bad. So, I think I'm going to have to enter the story. If he, if he casts some stuff, I need him to tap out because I know he's got counter magic. Alright. Now's my opportunity. Oh. I can counter his end of the story. Do I really care about it though is the question. Well, he's got enough mana up there, so... Yeah, I, I think I need to stop it. If he didn't have so much land, I would I would let it resolve and save that counter magic to, to protect my stuff when I'm casting stuff, but he's got so much mana, he can just pay for it.
I'm gonna draw again. Oh. Getting creatures back. Alright. Well, here's my opportunity to get tutelage down. Actually, I can get both tutelages down. Yeah, I think I want to do that. Pitch one of these. Um, probably can get rid of Crab now at this point. Crab ain't worth keeping anyway. He ain't gonna stick around. He's just gonna eat removal. Alright, he's down to 25 cards. Alright. Got all your rogues now. All right, all I want at this point is just lands. All right, let's go Calcapone. I'll counter it. All right. Let's see if you got another counter. What is that? Put into your hand. All right. You got that. And this is going to wrap it up. Discard two cards. Uh, yeah. Cry. Cry. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah this is the game get in the diamond guess I'll keep this don't have any early mill but got some counter magic some draw removal this person's playing blue hmm Peculiar. I don't think they can play anything. Well, I don't want to risk it. So let me just go ahead and play. I'll play crab. Get crab down first. I want to hold up that dispute, but. Uh oh, is he going to kill my crab? Yep, killing my crab. Alright. Now. Well, need that land. Play something blue so I can counter it. No, nothing blue. Alright. Just gonna hold my stuff up here. I want to play something. What are you playing? Is this rogues? Is I bet if I was a, if I was a bet man, I'd say this is rogues. Blue black. Not too many people are playing anything in blue black other than rogues are you stuck are you thinking I like your your championship pet here yeah rogues rogues uh do I care no I can yeah let me just counter the rogues I don't need him having three damage on board. Don't need that. 
Don't need those problems. Alright. He dies to removal. He dies to removal. Oh, no priority was held. I can go ahead and play my tutelage then. Alright, he's bouncing it. Bounced. Uh, I think the Merfolk Secret Keeper is probably... Probably what I don't need the most. Uh, it doesn't really block much of anything because everything, all the rogues fly. Uh, I'm gonna go for Cockapony. Hopefully they waste a counter on it. I'm fine with that. Counter it. Alright. Well, let me go ahead and draw some cards here then. Alright, they must they must have a Zareth in their hand. What do I have that they can steal? Crap. That's all you can steal. You're gonna you're gonna Zareth me for a crap. Yeah, you're gonna Zareth me for a crap. <laughs> crab is all you can get. Have fun with that. I'm fine with them having the crap. Uh, I'm going to pitch this swamp here. Guess I'm just going to go ahead and get this extra tutelage down now. Uh, I'll pitch this land. They may try to just go in on damage now. Alright. I thought that maybe they would want to just try to go in and get on, get on damage, but... Nothing's for you to steal, man. Uh, I need a land. I hope I draw a land here. Ah, uh, that's not a land. Alright, I pitched that. Since it wasn't a land. Calcapone you. Play Seeker Keeper so I can block his Zareth. Should have you should have should have bounced my Seeker Keeper. Nothing for you to steal but secret keepers. Alright, I just bought myself a turn. Any cards you got left? 16? Well, you have to count it is. Alright.
All right, I'm at nine. Don't have lethal. It's gonna be all she wrote, man. There's nothing you can do about it. It's over. It's quite over. Cry. 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 Cry me a river. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. GG. On to diamond. On to diamond we go. <laughs> Yeah! Mill! Play Mill. It's competitive. Because Stack said so. <laughs> what do your opponents do when they are facing your Mill? Cry! <laughs> Go forth and make your opponents cry with Blue Black Mill. Um, as I was recording this, footage i was told on facebook in the illustrious arena facebook group that um there's a probable ban coming down the pipeline tomorrow which is today is sunday night so it's monday tomorrow and i didn't watch any of the arena world championship coverage or whatever it was that happened this weekend but i imagine it was lots of omnath so um it's very shocking to me that I didn't run into very much Omnath while making um, this video. Well, actually, I didn't run into any Omnath. I ran into some adventure, but no Omnath. So it's weird. Is everybody like getting prepared for Omnath to be banned tomorrow? Is everybody like prepping for that? Is that what's happening? So I don't know. But um, definitely try this deck out against all the Omnath that's going on out there. Because when I did run against Omnath decks yesterday, I was faring rather nicely against those decks so you know i'm naff he likes to draw lots of cards so milling them out is the way to go um again if you have not already please like and subscribe all that good stuff and uh i will see you all next time